We are joined by Dustin Dean on the Monday Morning Zoo today, mind reader extraordinaire. He's about to read some minds. Are you guys ready? Oh boy. So ready. Let's We're ready. Let's do this. They seem very excited. Yeah, <laughs> a little so. nervous. I I'm definitely sense more nervous. I can't yeah, more nervous sense it. Me too. So I've given you some time to think on some drawings mm -hmm. that you're going to draw in just a moment. No one knows what this drawing is. You haven't told anyone. You haven't written this down beforehand or anything. No. You're just thinking of them. Yeah. Perfect. I want you to draw these drawings so that I can't see. If you want to hold them up towards you. Um, while they do that, I will tell you guys that um, before I came, this is very strange. I don't know if you guys have ever experienced um, deja vu. Um, I get this a lot, and I get these weird feelings. So when I woke up this morning, I got a bunch of weird feelings, and I had no idea what they meant, but I wrote them down. We'll get to that in a moment, and I've addressed that to you guys, Z89, and I've sealed that up. In a moment, we'll open that up. We'll get to that. Um, but for now, I just want you guys to just draw. Start drawing. Yep, start drawing, and uh, we'll see what I can pick up on. And um, I'm going to try to talk a bit so that you don't think I'm just listening to the sounds and the different strokes they're making. I don't want you to think that. Um, I can tell you right now, even as they're drawing, I can kind of get a sense of um, one I can tell is like an object. One is an object that's not living, but the other thing is also technically an object, but also living, if that makes sense. And I think um, they're both kind of small. I think these are both things you could kind of hold on to. One would be easier to hold with two hands and one with one hand. Um, let me know when you guys are done and just hold them close to you. Okay, well, so I finished. All right, <laughs> great. <laughs> so, so, can you hold out one hand for me? Yes. I apologize, my hands are kind of cold. We do live in Syracuse. <laughs> We've been having just wonderful weather. Um, Strange question, have you been thinking about traveling lately? Does that make any sense, or did you, you're planning something? I have been, yeah. Okay, and that makes sense. <laughs> With you, um, I get the sense that you are one of these people that is just very outgoing. You like to have a lot of fun, and I think you have, the weird like thing fun. is though, I think you have a small group of friends that I think you consider like, very like the closest friends that you put a lot of trust into but I think you are one of those people that like fits in with everyone like you're willing to just be friends with anyone just to have fun um, this thing that you're thinking of whatever you're drawing does this have any relevance to your life oh yeah Definitely. with you I'm getting it you're like visioning something I, or like I'm getting multiples of the same thing and this might not make sense but I think like I see you in like a field don't say yes or no but just think about it and I think with you this is something you see a lot and I think is this a basketball can we see it yes. and the basketball yes. and with yes, you, it is. is this like a flower Oh. Is it really? <laughs> it's a rose. Uh, it's a rose. So uh, I'm drawing. Wow. It's wow. Very good. Awesome. Um, Whoa. <laughs> oh, that's insane. Whoa. Here's the crazy thing. Remember before I told you I got these weird feelings like deja vu. Can you open that up for me? Oh no. <laughs> when I woke up this morning, I wrote some things down. It's sealed. Just try to tear that open. And there's a few different cards in there. If you can take them all out, make sure you get all of them. And read, well, you can kind of hold it so, yeah, we can see yeah, yeah. nothing else in there. So, first thing we have is a black cat. This morning, when I woke up, I wrote down black cat, and I didn't know why. But when I left my apartment, a black cat crossed my path. Now, you can believe that this is coincidence or fate. Yeah. You know, different people believe in different things. I'll leave that up to you. Okay. All right, go to the next card. The number 222. Now, this is where it got a little weirder. When I got into my car... I noticed that the time on my clock was flashing as if, you know, sometimes like the power goes out and for some reason it's flashing or something, but some reason it did that with my car as if I set it yeah. and it was 222. Okay. Still weird. Still very weird. We'll go to the next one. Five dollars. Five dollars. That's just the money I owed my fiance. That's not anything special. <laughs> um, but here's the weird thing. This didn't make sense to me until just now. I want you to take the last one off and read what that says. 
basketball whoa. and flower. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> 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 Which is what we just drew. Oh, that, so that all makes sense. The, whoa, that I don't know. Insane. I don't know. That is <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Oh. What? <laughs> what is going oh on? <laughs> Wow, that was <laughs> unbelievable. That's unbelievable. <laughs>